Hello everyone, welcome to Ready for Korea and through some videos I wanna teach you some Korean words using the technique I used to learn before but first of all I wanna apologize for my English because it's not the best you can hear so then let's get started with six Korean words those will be hello to be, the verb to be, as to say I am or it is or anything restaurant, what time is it, today and always. So the first word will be hello and you can use the same word to say hello and bye. And hello in Korean is año. Año. That you can relate it with when you see someone you can say hey I know you año. Hello año I know you I know hello. When you see someone I know you so I say hello in Korean to you. I know you so I say hello to you. Yes año I know. I know, I know. And to say bye, you can say like, you are that person, bye bye, I know, I know, I know you, bye bye. Like you are afraid from someone. And you say, bye bye, I know, I know you, I know, I know, bye bye. I think it's easy to remember, right? The second one is the verb to be. And the verb to be in Korean is adding in the end after name or thing, yeyo. If this word ends in consonant, and yeyo if this word ends with vowel. How you can remember that? You know there is some American or English, I think it's American expression when you see someone you say like Hey yo, what's up bro? Hey, hey yo, I'm under <laughs> So under yeyo Under yeyo Because ends with consonant the following word will be the restaurant that I think is important when you are looking for a restaurant. Sure. So the restaurant in Korean is Shiktang. Shiktang. That you can relate with a French soccer player. You know Sidan, Sinedin Sidan. And you can remember like, oh I was eating in the restaurant and it was Sidan in the next table. Like Sidan is in Shiktang. Sidan is in restaurant. Sidan Shiktang. Sinedin Sidan, Sinedin Shiktang, the French famous soccer player, is in the restaurant. Easy. The next three words, they, they will be related with time. So the first one will be, what time is it? Then when you wanna ask what time is it to some Koreans, you may say, Myoshi, Myoshi. This is also related with another soccer player that I think is the most famous in the world right now. That is Leo Messi. The Barcelona's player. So when you when you are going to ask the time, you have to remember. Oh, it's the Messi's time. Messi, Mioshi, it's the Messi's time. Messi, Mioshi, Messi, Mioshi, Messi. <laughs> the next is always. That always they say Hansang. Hansang. Nowadays, you know, the social networks are very famous as Facebook and this Hansang, we can relate it with Twitter. When you wanna some topic, you use hashtag, right? So always you are making hashtags. Hashtags, always. Hashtags, Hansang. Hansang, hashtags. Hashtag, 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 hashtag everything. Hashtag everything. Just remember, someone who is always writing Twitter hashtags. So handsome, always hacksaw. So the last word is today. That today is onul. Onul. To remember this word you can imagine like you are having a rent in some house. So you can say, oh today I need to pay the rent to the owner. Today I pay to the owner. Today onul. Onul, owner, owner, onul. Today, onu, onu, today. So those are the words for this lesson. I hope you learn. You have fun also. I hope I can make another video. So thank you to watch, learn Korean, and see you next time. Bye bye. Annyeong, I know.